Did you know that Mr. Beast is actually a multi-millionaire in crypto? He have an insane portfolio. Just today, we know that he have a portfolio of 800k and you will see i find a lot more than that not many people know this but mr beast may be up to something really big in crypto in the next bull market so that's why you should watch this whole video because this insight might change everything and today we're gonna dive in in all this portfolio find if he did some mistakes what are his good trades and what it is betting on now and before you rush in the comments to say how much you love me and you love this channel well it's not a multi-million dollar portfolio, really? Okay, what about his Bitcoin portfolio that we don't see here? He said he had his Bitcoin private key stolen on his laptop, but then got it back. That's stupid, never do that. Don't put your private key on your laptop. And it was nearly $2 million. Yeah, yeah, $2 million because he put 100K in it. So we know that he cashed out most of it, probably at 1.5 million or 2 million. Yeah, Mr. Beast have an interest in Bitcoin. He tweeted about it in February 2021. Then again, then again, then he put hashtag Bitcoin again. And the last tweet about crypto is 2021 November. So he basically wrote the bull market, a part of it and got out. How do I know that? Well, here I have his transactions three years ago when he sent 1.2 9k ethereum to binance us and when i checked the transaction it happened on the april 1st yeah no april fools for mr beast straight up profit well actually not that much because he sold it for almost two thousand dollars which is about the price of today he's kept on like ethereum going up to 5k but he made tons more with this video and also skipped on ethereum dipping down to almost 1k so technically i would say fair play on him and going out at that time of the bull market was quite good for him because he avoided to go into all the scams, Terra Luna, Anchor Finance, BlockFi and all that, that some of those influencers got. And by the way, if you're new to this channel, what am I doing here is I find the portfolio of some influencers and check what they have in it because the blockchain is an open ledger. It means every time there's a transaction, it's recorded on the blockchain. So if I know your address, I can know exactly which transaction you did, where did you send the money and all that. Before going into his token portfolio and what he made profit on and what he's betting on, let's check his NFT collection. By the way, what are we doing here, Mr. Beast? Didn't knew that about you. So you have a lot of crypto punks. When I say a lot, three is a lot. We can see some V friends, but you know what? I need more than that. I want to see how much money he made. And with his crypto punks, he made a lot of money. He invested 122K and now is around 350K. Fair play, Mr. Beast. You're not only good at making funny videos. What is hurting even my feelings though is V Friends, the one by Gary V. He invested 330 Ethereum, almost $1 million. They were best mates at that time. And V Friends got wrecked minus 97%. How on earth is that possible? Yep, that's not beautiful. Price of the sales, 325K. I'm, I feel sorry for the guy. To be honest, what are we gonna do with this JPEG? JPEG? Actually, let's check what's popping about V Friends, and we can see it's been complete disaster. It went down here at like now, the floor price is on average two Ethereum when it went up to 10 Ethereum, 12 Ethereum, and for the rare ones, even more. And the volume is super low. I mean, seriously, who want to buy this? Why? But let's stop crying. He still made a profit of 200K on his CryptoPunks, and I hope it would continue for him. By the way, Mr. Beast is active again because 10th of November, we get some transactions, and we have also on 13th of November, October, October, that was just like, I guess he received some stuff. But he just got back active into it. That's going to be something really interesting for the next bull market. Actually, did we start at the bull market? Let me know in the comments. What's your feeling about it? That's why now it's time to trade. We can see a big portfolio in Eternity Chain ERN token for 100k, Capsule Coin for 60k, Travel for 36k, and we got some Affin, some Ciders. Oh, we saw that one before, didn't we? Do you remember the other videos? I hope you do. I hope you watch all the videos. 
Anyways, let's see if he did some profit on that one. Is Mr. Beast a good trader? Wow, profit of plus 2 million. That's not possible. Okay, thank you. Sometimes the data is totally wrong. But he sold some of this ERN and bought some here. That's interesting. So he bought a quite a lot. And now if I check Capsule Coin, we have a loss of 150k. By the way, this coin is actually called Ternoa now. Caps, no cap. That's a terrible joke. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, but not sorry at the same time. I had to make it. And it's going up 12%. We can see in the last 7 days, 14 days, 1 year. That's pretty good. But we are still far away from the whole time high because it's minus 90%, which is normal. All the altcoins got wrecked. That's why I switched to Bitcoin before all the markets got totally wrecked. I was pretty lucky on that. Well, actually, it was based on data, but still, I'm happy I managed to do it. What about East Siders? He bought it before it was going up and bought it again here. So now he's still at a big loss. However, that's interesting that he bought a second time. Siders, for those who don't know, like I did before I did this research, is a Web3 gaming metaverse. Of course, it's in the space. We got Ternoa, that is an NFT chain, unleash the power of Web3. And we got Eternity, that is as well a metaverse and Web3 thing, particularly for NFT. Which opens to the last part. And I'm thinking, is Mr. Beast going to prepare an NFT collection for the next bull market? That could be. I could totally see this happening. And he would say X percent or all the profit would go to a charity. That would be a Mr. Beast move. He will raise up, I think, at least a million, maybe five million. I don't know. But I can see that he's invested in NFT a lot. He bought a lot of them and he bought into projects that are supporting this. So yeah, Mr. Beast might be just one like us, a degen. He's not as handsome as me, but he's way better at doing videos. So I will give him that. Now, what I'm going to do next is track all his addresses so I know exactly when he's going to do a transaction and I know what's happening. And as he started moving, Mr. Beast could be up to some big moves. And you know what can happen with Mr. Beast? If he tweet it or say it in the podcast, it will blow up. So that's why it's interesting to really follow what he's doing before he's saying it. If you want to know more about this, I will put a link in the description of how I do this and maybe you can do it as well. Anyway, it was a pleasure. You can check this influencer that have a really weird portfolio. I don't know why he did this, but there's some really good gems that actually we saw in this video as well. So if you triangulate this between few influencers, you're going to be flying. Anyways, stay handsome. Put a thumbs up if you like it. It was a pleasure. Ciao.